My name's Mark Lennon Jin, and I am pretty fun. I've got a lot of fans, so I am number one. There's old friends and new friends, a helicopter too. Through good times and bad times, we'll always get through. So now I've found a place where everyone will know. I am a big doofus. This is the Mark Lennon Show. Mark when engines got the ball again. He shoots. And Nah, uh, he scores? Yeah, you're emoting on my dead grave before that counts as a point. Well, I guess you make a point there. Still not a point. Hey, what's Blue Boy doing over there? I don't know, but he got the attention of the cars from next door. <laughs> Yeah, all right. Once that's tightened and this thing is fueled up, it'll be ready in no time. Hey, blue boy, what you doing over here? Ah, Marklin kid. I've been working all morning to fix up this bike. Once we're done, we're gonna ride it down the huge hill next to the house. Has that always been there? Hey, blue boy. After we ride, you wanna come over to our house and we'll do some stuff? Yeah, blue boy. You're like super cool and super popular. If I had a dollar for every second you were cool, you'd be super cool. Uh, always appreciated, gals. Now, why don't you run and get me the air pump so we can finish this? Oh, I'll grab it for you, Blue. I literally already got it. See? <laughs> Full hydrator. Hey, that's actually a water pump, girl, but uh, thanks anyway. Swing by in about an hour, girls, and I'll have it at the top for you. Wow, blue boy. So, which one of those two was your girlfriend? Oh, none of them. I don't have a girlfriend. <gasps> what? But, 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 what? But, but, but you're. It's so. <laughs> How is that possible? I heard Felicia Manswell paid 30 plus dollars just to get a picture with you in the background. All right, well, kid, to tell you the truth, uh, the reason I don't have a girlfriend is just because... Say no more, I getcha. You don't like the girls who come on strong to you. I understand how you feel. One day when I was taking out a book from the library, I had this woman come on real strong to me. And I said, hey, hold on. I don't like the type- Marquin Engine, if I had to guess, I think that was the librarian trying to tell you you had a fine, but, uh... Well, anyway, I get your point. And don't worry, there are plenty of girls out there. You should go and find one that's right for you. Hey, I've got an idea. This afternoon after you do your bike ride, I'll take you to a place where you'll probably meet hundreds. Ugh, that's okay. Uh, what I was trying to say was I really- Oh, blue boy, you poor thing. You're starting to self-doubt yourself. Don't worry. Tomorrow afternoon, we'll go. Great. Here we are. Uh, why did you bring me to the park? Because this is the perfect place to find any woman. A beautiful, peaceful, and slightly romantic setting that kind of smells like trash. By the time we leave here, you'll be hooked up for sure. Ugh, whatever. Hey, look, there's someone over there. Go, go introduce yourself. Mark Lamentz, I really don't wanna. I have to go home and take care of something important. Let me know how it went. Uh, hi. What the, what you reading there? I'm not reading, I'm writing a creepy pasta. Oh, uh, what's it about? <laughs> Well, I'm thinking of making it about a blue car who doesn't leave me alone and quit flirting with me while I'm trying to work. Hey, don't talk to me like that. You think I want to do this? I'm legit being for- Get out of my life! Whoa! Home run! Whoa! Ooh. Well, I never was a big baseball guy. Yeah, <sighs> what a crappy afternoon. What the? What is all this? 
Marklin kid, what's going on here? Uh, Monsieur Blue Boy, we can see you immediately. Psst, Blue Boy, it's me, Marklin Engine. Who could have guessed? So, how'd the afternoon in the park go? Did you find anyone? Oh, I found someone, all right. And she hated me. We hated each other. It just didn't go well. Ah, I thought you might say that. Which is why I took the liberty of preparing you this backup date, just in case. And just look who I got to be your date. Felicia Mantua! Man, am I good! Yeah, Mark Lenenji, cut it out, kid. I don't want to do this. Oh, well, it's good that you're telling me that now, because I got three people working the piano. You could have just asked me. Uh, no thanks, Bransley. We got it under control. Do you know how hard it is to get that guy to leave? Marklin Engine, you didn't let me finish earlier. The reason I don't have a girlfriend is because I don't want one. What? You don't want a girlfriend? No. I never have and I don't think I ever will. You see, some people are just different. Most people in the world find happy others and have romantic feelings for people, and that's great. A lot of people are really eager to find their first boy or girlfriend, but some people are just different. I've never been a person to feel things for anyone, and I'm completely fine with that. Some people just want different things in life. I hope you can understand that. Of course, Blue Boy. I wish I had known earlier. I'm sorry. It's fine. But you know, you should be more concerned about yourself. And it sure would be a shame to let this all go to waste. So you know what, kid? Why don't you take this date? You've never had a girlfriend before. Go for it. Really? You want me to go on this date with Felicia Manswell? You earned it, kid. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Okay, well, you gotta be facing her. Now, you have a great night with him, F Felicia. And I think that was really generous of you, what you just did for him. You know, you're a really nice guy. People like you don't come around too often. Haha, <laughs> well, thank you. This bag's under my eyes, God. All right, you two have a good night. Ugh. Now to get in my nice, comfy shoe. You know, you know you're a really, really nice, nice guy. guy. Guys, Guys like, like you don't, don't come, come around, around too often. Too. What? What is this feeling? What? No. No, Blue Boy, you're not falling in love. Come on, come on. The girl said two things to you. Get yourself together, man. She's Marklin Engines now. Don't let it... Yeah. No. And, oh, how could I be in love with someone that has the same voice as me? No, no! Huh. Huh. This is not good. Oh God. Here I am telling Marklin Engine he can have this girl. And meanwhile, I like her. Okay, look on the bright side, blue boy. Marklin Engine will probably want me to take her back. He's a pretty selfless guy. Blue boy! Ow. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But I just had to tell you thank you so much. Uh, well, I gotta tell you so- wait. Thanks for what? Oh, blue boy, I'm in love, I'm in love, I'm in love. And I don't care who knows it. Okay, that line sounds familiar, but what? Thank you so much for letting me take that date last night. You were right. I should have been looking out for myself more. I, I've i never felt like this before. I feel like there's a whole nother part of the world, and it's waiting for me. Thanks so much, blue boy. We're going camping tonight. Uh, oh, God. Hey, yo, blue boy, my boy. Blue boy. Bo Whatever. I heard about that thing you did yesterday with the bike. You mind taking me for a spin? Jake, I, I gotta ask you a theoretical question. Uh, okay. Let's say I like this girl. Like, really liked her. And I just want to spend more time with her no matter what. But, uh, someone else I'm friends with also feels the same way and is, you know, dating her. Oh. Well, then you'd probably be a really crappy person, and I wouldn't want to hang out with you anymore. But that's only theoretical, of course. Now, what do you say about that whole bike thing? I can't. I need to go somewhere. I need to find someone. I just can't turn off this feeling. Bro. 
All right, you're acting a little weird. Uh, I'll catch you later. Oh, I'm a jerk for doing this, but I just have to spend time with her. <laughs> <sighs> this was an awesome idea. I couldn't agree more. I'm glad we are what we are now. Oh, uh, hey, fancy running into you guys here. Blue Boy, what are you doing here? Okay, you know what? I'm sorry. I can't take this anymore. I feel like a real jerk, but Marklin Engine, can I talk to you? What is it, Blue Boy? Marklin Engine, I know I'm a humongous jerk and you'll never forgive me, but I can't keep this on my chest. I love Felicia Manswell. You what? But what about that whole thing about never love? I know what I said before, but I can't contain this. The way she talked to me last night, like it, it touched me in a way. But I feel so guilty because I know that you're in love with her. And after what I did to set you up, there's no way I can take this back. I tried to hold it in and just be happy for you, but something inside me just drove me. I just wanted to spend more time with her. So I came here. <laughs> oh, Blue Boy! You thought I was in love with Felicia Manswell? What, what do you mean? Of course you are. You said so this morning. No, me and Felicia are just friends. I was in love with her pet chickens. I went to her house yesterday and I just couldn't get over them. Yeah, she's one of the neighbor's cars, if you didn't know. Oh. Oh my gosh, I feel so stupid. Yeah, we just came here as friends. But honestly, Blue Boy, if you want her, I'd be more than happy to give her to you. Besides, I think she likes you anyway. She kept bringing you up. Oh, well, thank you, Marco Engine. I appreciate that. Now, I'll leave you two alone. You have a good evening. I never thought I'd say this, but I love you, Felicia Manswell. <laughs> I love you too, Blue Boy. <sighs> ah, well, hey, lover boy. Where's the date? Eh, I did what I thought was right and let him have her. Told him I was in love with the chickens. Ah, chickens lie, eh? Well, care to join the singles table for one? <laughs> sure. Love is blue, Chris. Love is blue. Sure is, Mark One Engine. Oh, by the way, you can't play that card. Yes, I can. No, you can't. That doesn't count as a point. Yes, it does. No, that's not a point. Ugh. You know what? I'll let you have this one. <laughs>